recently the amazing first trailer for the Suicide Squad dropped. And I know that there is some confusion about it. People want to be excited, but some people are confused. So I just wanted to break down a few things because I am beyond pumped for it. First off, it is not actually connected to the Suicide Squad movie that came out from David Ayer a little while ago. Uh, whether that movie was bad because of studio meddling or whatnot, who knows? But you might be saying, but well, there's some cast returning. Yes. The actors and actresses that were incredible in that movie, that have nothing to do with why it was an issue, are back. We've got Harley Quinn, we've got Amanda Waller, we've got Rick Flagg, as far as characters. In terms of the new cast, we have Bloodsport, Polka Dot Man, Ratcatcher 2, King Shark, TDK, Mongol, Javelin, Weasel, Savant, Blackguard, The Thinker, Soul Soria, of course Peacemaker, uh, and more. Not everyone is going to make it out of this movie alive. That has been a promise. <laughs> we'll see how many of those characters uh, end up staying to the credits point. Uh, and let's not forget that this movie is only happening because Marvel dropped James Gunn from Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3 amid bullshit online. But because of that, we are now getting this DC movie that's directed by him and well, also written by him. And we're getting a spin-off HBO Max uh, television series that is going to be focused on Peacemaker, who looked hilarious from the trailer. And not only that, we're still getting Guardians of the Galaxy 3. So it's truly win-win all around here. So don't worry if you never saw Suicide Squad. I wouldn't even bother seeing it. It's It's got its issues. But this movie, I think, is potentially going to be James Gunn's best movie yet. But regardless of whether you made a pact to save the world or die trying, make sure to find the A in every day. Bye.